Imagine a weapon so volatile, so technologically advanced, that it seems like it belongs in a high-budget sci-fi movie. A mobile cannon that fires boiling liquid bullets at machine gun speeds. Now, imagine this weapon is living, breathing, and crawling right under your feet. Welcome to the damp, dark world of the forest floor. Here, survival is a brutal game, and usually, the big eat the small. But there is one tiny creature that breaks all the rules. Meet the bombardier beetle. To the naked eye, it looks like an ordinary, innocent bug. It scurries over wet leaves, looking for food, seemingly defenseless against the giants of the undergrowth. A hungry toad watches from the shadows. It sees an easy, crunchy snack. The toad strikes, its sticky tongue wrapping around the beetle, pulling it into its mouth. In any other story, this is the end. But the bombardier beetle has a secret weapon hidden in its rear. Deep inside its abdomen, there is a chemical laboratory that would make human engineers jealous. It holds two distinct reservoirs. In one tank, hydrogen peroxide. In the other, hydroquinone. Separately, they are completely harmless. But the moment that toad attacks, the beetle triggers a biological valve. The fluids rush into a reinforced, thick-walled explosion chamber. Special enzymes are added, and instantly, a violent chemical reaction occurs. The liquid doesn't just get hot, it flash boils. It reaches 100 degrees Celsius, the boiling point of water, in a fraction of a second. The pressure builds until it cannot be contained. With a distinct popping sound, a turret on the beetle's rear end swivels. Yes, it can aim with terrifying precision. It fires a jet of caustic, boiling steam directly into the predator's sensitive mouth. And it's not just one splash. The beetle pulses its muscles, firing a rapid staccato burst up to 500 times per second. It is a biological machine gun. The toad, burned and shocked, instantly regurgitates the beetle. Smoke literally rises from the battlefield. The predator flees in pain, while the beetle simply walks away, miraculously unharmed by its own internal explosions. It is a master of chemical warfare, proving that in nature, size means absolutely nothing when you are packing a bomb.